How's it going, everybody? Midnight Silver Run. And I got another 14 pound package from Scent Hoarder. This one's gonna be amazing. I can't wait. Um, I will start by saying this. I try to uh, record through YouTube, and when I do, it tells me asset not readable. So I'm going to just record it on my camera or my phone, and then I'm going to have to fix whatever it is, and then hopefully that works so I can actually upload it. So with that being said, hopefully I'm not recording this video for nothing. I already got the box open. Try to hide all the information. As you can see, we get the bubble wrap off here. Push this back. Um, I guess we can start off with this. I had a, a stamp collection that I had got from my great grandpa when he passed away. Um, Sam Hoarder knew somebody that uh, is knowledgeable and uh, you know, that type of thing. So I uh, sent it to him and had him uh, have his guy look at it. Here's something cool. from Chattanooga and on the back of it, it says Battle of Chickamauga so I don't know if this is something to do with uh, was it the Civil War the Civil War or not but pretty cool just a bunch of old stuff in here maybe one day I can go through that that was uh, just some more family -ish stuff I decided to keep um, when I got rid of the stamps As always, we know I love my Lincolns. So I actually got a nicer um, memorial date and shield so I can upgrade the later half of my Lincoln uh, Dance Co. album with the proofs. So that's, <laughs> that's pretty awesome right there. I guess I can turn the light on. And I can move, move the box to let a little more light in here. Nice, beautiful coins, though. Very cool. And then I can use the sleeves to start putting uh, my flips in. Look, satin finish. Satin finish, satin finish, satin finish. Oh, this is a nice one. Got the 2009s, I needed those because some of them are a little funky in my album. Very nice. Oh, that's gonna be awesome to upgrade. That is gonna be very awesome. So yeah, this will be a, a fun little uh, evening of uh, album upgrading to do. Looking forward to that one. Um, I guess we'll do, oh, oh yeah, that's right, that's right, I remember. Okay, yeah, it's because there's two of them. All right, guys, now this one is a real, real cool one. Check out these albums, more albums. One of the Roosevelt Dimes is not mine. Um, I bought almost a complete one, or semi-complete, and uh, I think he was in the process of moving, because um, he was going to keep it. Look at this, guys. He was going to keep it, and I kind of, uh, look at that toner right there. You can't really see it in the camera. Look at this. So I'll have to go through, go through this one, I believe. Yeah. Well, I'll have to, I guess I'll have to ask him for sure. Maybe these go in the other one, but 
vice versa and so forth. But look at that. I have almost a complete Roosevelt album of some beautiful BU coins. Totally worth it. Totally worth it. That is awesome. We'll look at the we'll look at the albums or well we'll go through the albums a little bit later. Washington Quarters. I, this one is awesome. Can't wait to start working on this one. I'm gonna have so many albums going, guys. It's not even funny. Well, it is kind of funny. It's so cool. But the cream of the crop, as they say, guys. Check this out. United States typeset. I've been waiting for this one. I've been wanting to do this one so bad. As you guys know, I've been kind of buying some coins for it. So I have, uh, definitely have uh, some coins to put in this bad boy. And actually, there's some coins in this box that'll be going in it. And check this one out. A brand new Liberty Nickel album, brand new. Oh, this is awesome, dude. Check that out. I, I don't have very many Liberty Nickels. Um, I do have a couple, but uh, not a lot. So this is gonna be fun to really do because it'll give me some more coins to look for. Okay, let's see what is in this bad boy. I don't understand. I think the scale at the post office is uh, broke there, buddy. Because this one says it weighs more than the last one, and it definitely didn't feel like it weighed more than the last one. It feels lighter than the last one. So you might want to tell them they need to uh, check their scales, because uh, I think something's a little fishy with that. I'm going to grab a pair of scissors real quick, guys. Usually I try to uh, try to cut through this stuff a little nicer so I can uh, save some of the save some of it so I can you know I mean I don't want to sound cheap or whatnot but if I can use some bubble wrap or a box and and reuse it then I figure it saves everybody a little bit of money because then maybe they can reuse it. Check this out, guys! A silver bullet, silver bullet. I want one of these so bad. That is awesome. Check that out. Very cool. And this little guy right here. show you the back even though there's no uh no writing just a cool little diamond design that is awesome that is so cool i'm not a big 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 collector of silver but when i find something i kind of like you know i want it i get it or try to anyway all right guys these would be upgrades more upgrades for the Lincoln album, so I can move my 1914 toner into the toner album. The 26S that I have, that's a toner, into the toner album. Um, the 23 as well, it's another beautiful toner, but it needs to go in the toner album. And so does the 25S. So these are, these are upgrades, replacements. Very cool, thank you a lot for those, man. I've been wanting those. And now here we go, man. I haven't seen, I mean, I've seen these coins, but this is, you guys, this is cool. Really, really cool right here. Start off one at a time. Look at that. It does have a hole in it, but I do not care. It is a trade dollar. And it is a nice looking trade dollar. He's messaging me right now. Come on, man, I'm trying to film a video. Look at that. And of course that is for 
the typeset. Look at that, guys. That is so awesome. Very, very cool coin. Um, I don't know for those. I don't know a lot of, a lot about the trade dollar, but I believe this was used um, or made to uh, mainly be used overseas in China, I believe, back in the day. Hence why it's called the trade dollar. And then we have... I'll take this bad I'm going to take this one out. Put my hands on it. The Pilgrim. Silver half dollar commemorative. This is also going to go in the typeset. I think pretty much everything in here, for the most part, is going to go in the typeset. Very, very cool. Check that out. Oop. I think I want to do, um, like Santa Horta keeps talking about, I want to do, uh, I think I want to do a silver commemorative um, album. I mean, that, that won't be very easy to do, though. Now, a lot of these we're going to get into. I'm not exactly sure what they are. I have to do a little information. I mean, I know what they are but I don't know what they are. So I think I'll slide each one of these out slowly. Well, not slowly, but you know what I mean. I'll slide them out so we can look at it. I think it might be a, is it a seated core. Oh, wait a minute. This might be one of those things he slid in there that I don't remember. Where's the... I'm here, guys. I'm just, uh... I don't know. I have to look it up. I think it's the 20-cent piece. I don't remember. Right off the top of my head. I believe that's what it is, though. Don't hate me if I'm wrong, because <laughs> there's a good chance I am. <laughs> I believe that is the 20 cent piece though. I believe, hold on. I don't know, I got coins in here that. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's, that's the 20 cent piece, it's gotta be. Final answer, 20 cent piece. Now these ones, this is a, I think this is a draped bust heft set. I believe that's what this one is. I gotta start um, researching this stuff. I've, I've, I didn't start getting into it till the last few weeks, to be honest. Very cool coin. I just <clears throat> wanted a typeset, so I just kind of started getting coins for the typeset. without completely uh, knowing exactly what each coin was. <laughs> Here's a beautiful toned uh, 43. Why am I holding it? Yes, I will take it out. I will take it out. Come on out of there. Look at that, guys. You gonna zoom in there, bud? Come on. work for me please still got beautiful detail really really cool color especially the reverse One of these 
this. I believe this is the, I think this is the draped bust. I don't know, guys. I'm not, like I said, no stem. Small six, I believe is what it is. Of course, it could be vice versa. This could be, <laughs> this could be it, and this could be the other one. <laughs> I'll get it figured out, guys. I mean, I know what they are, but I don't know what they are, so. A little more research, it never hurts anyone, right? Gives me uh, a reason to look stuff up. Now, this is a really cool foreign coin. I believe this is a Netherland East Indies. Do it. This thing is really cool. Okay, oh, hold on. Is that right? Yeah, that's gotta be right. Or is it right? Or is it like that? No, it's gotta be like that. Crown up, right? I like that. That's really cool. I like how it's like a. Uh, a coat of arms or something. 1734. It might actually be the oldest coin I have now. I don't care. What, uh. This one is also going in a typeset. And this is, I'm not going to touch this one. But this is almost semi proof like. catch it the beautiful 43 that mm. yeah, definitely said my proof like it's just hard with these lights Not the clearest, but it's uh Oh my camera sucks on these on these uh on these nicer looking coins. This one is a beauty. I got a really cool one I'm gonna say for last, so that one I've been excited about. This thing is awesome. Look at the toning on that thing. Look at that, guys. Full of luster. Nice BU toned coin. Look at that. You guys know me. When I see a toned coin that I really like, I gotta have it. This is a beauty right here. This is a stunner. Look at that. That is definitely the nicest Mercury dime I have. Look how nice that is, guys. Love this design. Here's another upgrade for the Lincoln album because my 52S is brown and ugly. <laughs> it is the only brown and ugly one on that page, so I had to uh, had to make it right. Come on. Stop being like that. Now working with me, guys. Beautiful coin. That would definitely be a really good upgrade. And then I got these, uh, these are cool. 
one for the typeset and probably one for the album. They are. Nice BU. Bicentennial 40 percenters. Now, of course, you know we gotta check them for the DDO. I'm sure they've already been checked a hundred times over, but you know, doesn't matter. Look how beautiful these coins are. I think there's three proofs and then, uh, I don't remember if it was three. I think there's three proofs and three of another one. I don't remember. Someone didn't, uh, Check this out. You can't see it though. We got a couple of the reverses. I think we already did, but wow, it's going, guys. Beautiful. All right, guys. We have one more coin to look at, and this one is uh, really, 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 really cool. It is, uh, I want to look for myself. Yeah, that's so, that's so cool. Here you go, guys. I give you a toned BU. So check this out. If I can work the foot. It is a Bugs Bunny. I guess I can see if I can, uh, where's my camera at? No, we're not gonna see it. <laughs> Check this out, guys. A Bugs Bunny. I don't know why, but this is one of those ones that uh, when I had the opportunity to get, I couldn't uh, couldn't pass it up. And on top of it, it's just really cool, like rainbow tone to go from silver and just fades into like an orangish, pinkish, purplish, reddish, bluish, greenish. Oh, that's that's so awesome. You can see the array of colors a little better on the back. So beautiful. Totally worth it right here. Totally worth it. So yeah, we will, uh, I guess I'll make, uh, well, I don't guess. I'll make some uh, videos coming up. We'll do some upgrades. Um, fill the typeset with what we got. Start this bad boy. Switch these over. To the one album. I believe this is the one album I'm keeping. The one with the... Leave him the nicer looking one. It doesn't really matter to me. Very cool. And then, of course, we cannot forget. Oh, oh, one fell out somewhere. I heard it go. It's a 2013 assist back page. It tried slipping out earlier. And then, of course, we got to fill or upgrade the other album. The one that started all of this, my Lincoln album. Why is that page not sitting right? There we go. 
So, can't forget about my baby. Looking forward to doing that. Well guys, hope you hope you enjoyed the video. I got some uh, coins to sit here and enjoy and look at. Very cool. So big. Hey, where's the comparison? The memory of this, uh, pretty badass, too. At least in my opinion. I think these commemoratives might be one of my more favorite coins now, actually. The more I uh, start looking at them, the more I just... There's a couple that are really awesome. The, the Gettysburg, the Antietam. Really, really cool. Can't forget about the Silver Bullet. Watch out, werewolves. You're in trouble. Grand Bar. <laughs> Don't gotta worry about uh, werewolves around here. Or, uh, our city's in the middle of a, a pretty nasty gang war. There's been like 10 people shot. They're shooting everywhere. It's crazy. the classic head draped bust if I remember correctly now classic head draped bust I believe I believe that's how it went <laughs> very very cool guys hope you enjoyed the video I know I surely did and I can't wait to start putting these coins in some albums all right, everybody, you be safe out there and you take care. Have a good one.